UK Prime Minister Rishi Sunak pledged on Friday the country's biggest package of defence aid to Ukraine worth £2.5 billion during a visit to Kyiv. This will include more air defence equipment, more anti-tank weapons, more long-range missiles, thousands of rounds, more ammunition and artillery shells, he said, in addition to more military training. Sunak also announced a new security agreement between the two countries that will last a hundred years or more during his news conference with Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky. He added that the UK and other European countries can't falter in their support of Ukraine because if Putin wins in Ukraine, he will not stop there. It comes at a time when other financial aid from the US and Europe is tied up by political wrangling. Kiev has been urging the West to send more aid as the grinding conflict brings little change along the front line and both sides turn to long range strikes. Sunak said he made Ukraine his first foreign trip of the year to send a strong signal of support. We'll never be alone. Putin might think that he can outlast us, but he is wrong. We stand with you today, tomorrow, and for as long as it takes. Because this war is about Ukraine's right to defend itself and to determine your own future and the Ukrainian people's historic choice to be an independent democracy at the heart of Europe. Because if Putin wins in Ukraine, he will not stop there. And our opponents around the world believe that we have neither the patience nor resources for long wars. So waver now, and we embolden not just Putin, but his allies in North Korea, Iran, and elsewhere. Our actions right now will determine the future path of the war. So far from our resolve faltering, the United Kingdom is announcing today our single biggest package of defence aid to Ukraine since the war began, worth two and a half billion pounds. This will include more air defence equipment, more anti-tank weapons, more long-range missiles, thousands of rounds more ammunition and artillery shells, training for thousands more Ukrainian servicemen and women, and £200 million to build thousands more drones the single largest package of drones given to Ukraine by any nation. In total, since the war began, the UK will have provided almost £12 billion of aid to Ukraine. And I'm proud that today President Zelensky and I have signed a new security agreement that will form the core of a partnership between our two countries that will last a hundred years or more. This is the first in a series of new bilateral security assurances promised to Ukraine by 30 countries at last year's Vilnius summit. And it says that if Russia ever invades Ukraine again, the UK will come to your aid with swift and sustained security assurance. So, uh, Prime Minister, could you please explain uh, what in the EU does it guarantee to Ukraine? Uh